Captain Wiggly, yeah. I was a sailor of seven seas. I broke a lot of hearts. And every for Susie from Hong Kong, oh Susie. Ah oh, Susie, oh Susie Susie. Yeah, yeah. Lots of broken hearts out there. Captain Wiggly. What a pity to come check to. Where's your breakfast? Captain. <laughs> Captain. Hello, Captain. Hello. What do you want? Hello. What do you want? I have to talk to you. Not now. I'm very busy. I've got a breakfast. Well, you're always busy. Well, I'd like to be busier. You don't help matters. I come here. Cause trouble. <laughs> to ask you for the rent, which you haven't paid for three months. And I want down payment right now. Yeah, no, no but cut me some slack, please. No way. Yeah, in, in a week, the, the campers will be coming, you see, from Japan, all over the world, for Wiggly's full English. You get your money. Well, okay, but you have to leave me alone now. I have to prepare breakfast. Yep, breakfast? Y yes. It's quite late in the day. No, 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 no. Anyway, give me, give me some room, would you? See you later. I'll, I'll do my best. I'll see you later, for sure. Yeah, uh, uh, no, but I'll do my best. I'll find the money somehow. Grandma's got a few bob. I'll try and get some money from her. <laughs> ah. Good afternoon. Hello, is this Captain Wiggly's camping? It is Captain Wiggly's camping. I am Captain Wiggly. I am the captain. How can I help you? It's quite late in the day. Do you still serve breakfast? Yeah, we, we serve breakfast all day long. Please sit down, sir. Uh, I'll be right with you. Sorry, the eggs... Uh... What the hell is this? Uh, I'll be right back, sir. I've just got a few things. Got some beans. You can see this is an English breakfast, but what the hell is this? Well, we're here in the Costa Brava, and I like to give the, the full English a, a flavour of the Mediterranean. So, hence the rosemary. I think you'll enjoy it, sir. Shall I serve you a sausage? Are these sausages British sausages? They're traditional local sausages called butifara. Butifara? Butifara. Butifara? Yes, sir. Would you like me to serve you? Are these sausages gluten-free? Yes, sir. Everything is gluten-free. Shall I serve you, sir? Or well... I'm allergic to mushrooms. Organic, this is very sir. high cholesterol. Beans make me fart. The free range eggs, sir. As for your farting, sir, I wouldn't suggest you had too many, but I'm sure you'll be fine. No, this is too much. Uh, bring me an intercontinental breakfast, young man, and make it snappy. And also <laughs> make sure that the orange juice is organic and freshly squeezed. And I hope the croissants are gluten-free. I also like my croissant long and not curved on the end, please. Well, I'm sorry you feel like that. I, I, I'll uh, take these away and, and then I'll be back directly. Thank you. I'm sorry, sir, but we're, we're right out of everything. Croissants are... Uh, orange juice, but please have this glass of water on the house. No charge. Uh, please come back again next week. We'd like to see you and we'll do, the, do a better job. I do apologise. Uh, thank you for the water, but I have got my own water. Thank you very much. Coconut water. Um, anyway, you have a nice place and uh, I'll be back. Well, I do hope so. Captain Wiggly, it's me again. Fuck off! Can I have some of this putty No, 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 no. But you keep your sticky fingers away from the sausages, if you don't mind. It's still hair Norbert for you. You understand? And if you're not pleased with the arrangements, I will raise well, the rent. Simply. Oh no, no! Please don't do that. Yep,
Captain Wiggly. Yes, Miss Saki. Breakfast is ready. Name no sake, name Suki. Yes, Miss Suki. Would you like your breakfast now? Captain Bigley, come. Suki, make breakfast for you. Norbert, I'm busy. And keep your fingers out of the Butivara pot. Of course, Captain. You can trust me. Now go and do your job with Miss Saki. Oh, Suki, I'm sorry. <laughs> Suki, darling, I'm here. Oh, mummy. Uh, <laughs> oh, look, the spider. Ooh. <laughs> oh, Suki, darling. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, sayonara, putifara. <laughs> sayonara, putifara. <laughs> mm. oh. Who are you? And what do you want? Are you the owner of uh, Captain Wiggly's camping? Yes, I am. You see, monsieur, I want to rent the camping from you. I have a chain of uh, nudist camping all over the world. You know nudist? Oh la la. Okay. I listen. You throw the captain out, and I will rent the camping from you. And I will pay the double to you. The double, hmm. He has a 10 years contract. And this is first year. Only one year has passed. I cannot throw him out. I would like to get rid of him though. Yes, I would like to get rid of him. This is here, the Costa Brava. And we are close to a village called Caracas where the famous painter of Salvador Dali has lived and worked. Lots of tourists come here. Hot tourist spot. But the Captain Wiggly's camping is always empty. I don't know why. He has not paid the rent for three months. I have ways to give up his contract. Have you? Oh. We will make him drunk the French way and he will sign the renunciation. Leave this matter to me. To me, monsieur. Maurice, Herr Norbert. Monsieur Maurice, you have no idea about the captain. I've seen the captain drink a whole bus full of Russian tourists under the table in the bar. Nobody drinks like the captain. It will not work. He's always the last man standing, always the last man. But he has a weakness, and this is love. He falls in love with every woman in sight. You make him fall in love, Maurice. And then you can manipulate him. Okay. You have a deal? Yes, you know that. I have just the right ladies for that job. They are called Esmeralda and Gypsy Lee. Esmeralda and Gypsy Lee. That sounds quite suspicious. But there may be other ladies. The right ladies for the job, Maurice. Well, auf Wiedersehen, Herr Maurice. Auf Wiedersehen. See you later, Herr Norbert. Au revoir. Captain, hello, hello. Anybody home? Capitano. Hi, hi. Hello. Oh. The full English. So oh, where's the captain? Oh, I will have a little bit of that.
Captain, wake up. Been drinking this rum again. Wake up, wake up. Ah, Norbert, what the hell are you doing? My friend Maurice will be here any moment. Maurice is my new business partner. Lovely French man. I think you will like him. Who is Maurice? And who's taken the breakfast? Was it you again? No. Again you take the breakfast? No, 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 no. No, no. Oh, yes. All the time you're stealing my sausages. Again and again. Leave the sausages alone. Do you understand? Do I speak clearly? I never steal your sausages. I don't like uh, the full English. Uh, you, think you should better take care about these wild cats around here. I think that's the ones which are stealing your sausage. Yes. And Maurice is coming soon. Now prepare for the meeting. Brush up a little bit. And by the way, Captain, I eat Wiener Schnitzel, Wiener Schnitzel, all day long. And that one day you shall have with me. Captain, are you here? What do you want, Norbert? My visitor will come any moment. And he wants to talk to you about managing your camping. He has some very good ideas. Hello, Senor Norbert. Herr Norbert, please. Herr Norbert. Welcome, Maurice. I will introduce you to the captain. Hello, Monsieur Maurice. Bonjour. Captain Wigley. Monsieur Maurice, my name. How can I help you? What do you want? I'm here to talk about your camping. I'm a very, very successful businessman. I, I listen. What do you have in mind? I'm the manager, me, Maurice, of an international chain of nudist camping. <laughs> Are you insane? I have a serious family camping business here. Well, Monsieur Captain... I want to manage your camping. I want to change it into a nudist camp. You know, we can make much money and you can pay Herr Norbert the rent. Norbert can wait for the rent. No, 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 no naked people in my camp. Get out of here. Let us talk about the business. No nudist camp. Get out of here. Herr Norbert, Herr Norbert. Yeah, Maurice. This man is dangerous. Get out of here and never come back. Do you hear? Never come back. He's completely crazy. Foo. Or I'll shoot you down. Get out. Maurice, come here. I know he's a little mad, but he's a good cook. Come here. Yes, Herr Norbert. I never come back. But just, I'll show you something. Sausages from the captain. Oh, you want one? Yeah. Well, run off before he sees you. Oh, Conchita, darling, I love you. Oh, mi capitan, mi capitan. Faster! Más rápido! Faster! Faster! Yeah! Darling, I love you! Conchita! Oh, oh, oh mi capitán! Love. Mi capitán! Oh, chico! What the hell is this? Oh my God, what is that? Who are you? are you? What do you want? Are you Captain Wigley? I am, sir. Ah. What do you want? Can't you see I'm busy? We're here to make you an offer that you can't refuse. Which you cannot refuse. We need your camping site for a big rock festival. Rock festival? Well, yeah. Not sure about that. We got a lot of big names coming. Really? 
Well, it doesn't really interest me, to be honest with you, sir. Remember, this is an offer we said you cannot refuse. Well, I don't know about pop festival. I really think this is a very good idea at all. Well, now that he's taken care of, it's time to call the boss. Rock festival, big names. Wow, could make some money. Famous people. Oh, my God. Hello, who are you? Can I help you? We don't like strangers here, so be off with you. My name is Tibor. I'm from Hungary, looking for work. I just work for food. Please give me work. Ah, oh, Tibor, eh? Well, I, I could use a handyman around here. There's plenty to do with the campsite. Do you know anything about gardening? A lot of work in the garden. Yes, I do. Yeah, I, I need help in the kitchen. Can you cook? Yes, I do. Can you tidy the camping? I, I need someone to keep it in ship shape order. Yes, I do. My landlord, Herr Norbert, he likes to go in the kitchen and take the sausages from the pot. Now, I'd like you, if you can, keep an eye on him. Old-fashioned spy work. Yes, I can. My last question, Tibor. Can you repair a broken heart? No, I cannot. I can see you're an honest man, so when can you start? I can start right now. Well, th this is excellent. You can start right away. OK. Sugar, how far is it to the camping? Oh, it's just around the corner, Candy. Come on, Cherry. Yeah, I feel so hot. Are we gonna be there soon? Captain Wiggly! Anybody home? Oh, look, there's a bell. Captain, Captain Wiggly! Yes, what is it? Well, hello. Camping, breakfast at six o'clock. My name is Captain Wiggly. Now, what are your names? My name is Candy. 
Her name is Cherry. And her name is Sugar. Can we camp here? When is the Big Rock Festival? How much does the camping cost? The girls stay here for free, but you have to pay for breakfast. Captain Wiggly, we're on a special diet. We only eat the fruits of love. The fruits of love? You can stay here for free. No breakfast. Fruits of love? But how do you nourish yourself? We eat candy all day long, but sometimes we eat cherries. And all that with loads of sugar. So what kind of amusement do you have here? Where are the boys? We have a chess board, uh, we have volleyball, and at the weekend we have bingo. <sighs> Don't you have a swimming pool? We, we feel really hot. My landlord has a pool. We can use it. Now follow me. Welcome. Enjoy your holiday. Can, Can we, we be naked, Captain Wiggly? No, 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 no. This is a family business. No way. Girls in the pool. Come on, give me your bras. Come on, give me your bras. Give me your bras. Oh! Oh. I can't swim. <laughs> 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 You still need some help, Captain? No, 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 I'm fine, fine. Ask as if sometimes, why do you like the full English so much? I grew up with Wiener Schnitzel, very good food in Vienna. The full English, what is it about? The fried tomatoes, the champignons, the toast, the sausages. I don't understand. Strong wind today, eh? Hey? From Montana? Yeah. And Putifara, wunderbar. Quan Jotania Poxais Al Param Duya Alabar. Yam de ya quan sigis gran, no te fies mai de la calma, castiga siempre 
la guay y si la la tramontana Juan Bellis fui a zapar dejarás la arca cavada bufa menstrual bufa mi That. Was that for real? Call the cash. Well, call the cash. Tell me, Murphy, how many people will come to the festival? I mean, uh, how much money can we make? Well, boss, I estimate it to be about 5,000 people, which at 50 bucks a ticket, ends up being 250 large. A quarter of a million. Hey, this is good money. Tell me, our main attraction, the diva, you worked for him before as a bodyguard? What's he like? He's a Swedish superstar. He's, he's pretty eccentric, but uh, his new album, The Blue Pharaoh, is currently number one in the US, uh, the UK, Sweden, and Japan. So, uh, how much does he ask? Uh, what's his cut? Well, I told him this is a benefit concert and that the money is going to the poorest of the poor. Which, in this case, is us. But he doesn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Murphy. Well done. The Seven Seas are... Skipper, get over here. It's time for you to meet the boss. I can see you've met Murphy and Spider before. Yes, I've met Murphy and Spider before, and they gave me a, an old-fashioned beating. It wasn't very nice, I could tell you. I assume our deal is final, then? Shall we talk business? Do you have any questions now? Yes, yes, I have a question. How much money will I make? Uh, what's my cut? I tell you, Captain Wiggly, successful business involves politics, power, and influence. Hard work, teamwork, and integrity. And from time to time, a little ass kicking. You understand me, Captain Wiggly? Well, that's very interesting, but how much money will I make? Don't be so greedy, Capitano. It'll be completely set up, completely taken care of. I think I understand you, Senor Marco. We just got a phone call from the diva's assistant. He's got a few demands. What does he want now? Well, apparently he's into some new cocktail called the Blue Pharaoh's Lollipop. What the hell is that? Well, his assistant said you take three liters of vodka, a little bit of dragon blood, and some kind of powdered Amazonian toad. You know where to get all of that? I mean, I can find it. What about you, Skipper? Well, I've no, I've no, I've no idea what you're talking about. What else does the diva want? Well, apparently, he needs his shaman flown in from India. He wants the clubhouse full of white lilies. And he said absolutely no groupies. Done. No problem. Wiggly, we're putting you in charge of logistics, drinks, and we need you to find two people that you know you can trust for ticket sales. Because that's where the money, and that's where the profit lies. Oh, Mr. Murphy, where in this godforsaken world can I find two honest people? Hey, Esmeralda! Here, have a drink with me! 
Oh, no, thank you. Where is Maurice? He borrowed money from me, and I want it back. Yeah, me too. I gave him all I had, and I don't think we're gonna see him again. God damn this, Maurice. I'm gonna put a spell on him. No, wait. Don't you know how to do love spells? Of course I know how to put love spells on people. I have an idea. Jujang gypsies have forgotten everything about our traditions. Maurice told me that he was going to rip off a camping place owned by an English captain. But wait a minute. The captain only rents the place. The real owner is a filthy, rich Austrian guy. We have to be careful. Maurice told me that the captain is a very violent man. Ooh, I like my man. Rough and violent. The other man, Norbert, is a very soft gentleman. And, they say, is very, very rich. Oh, I like a true gentleman, and I like to get expensive presents. Then you, Esmeralda, put a love spell on these two guys and go and see if there's anything in there for us. I demand, I demand love. How was my love spell, Esmeralda? Not bad for a beginner. Okay, let's go get the cap. Captain Wiggly! Is this love that I'm feeling? Is there anybody out there that can repair a broken heart? What is the purpose of your visit? Are you looking for love? Yes, Captain. It's love we are looking for. But also, a job. We need money. By the way, where is Norbert? But Norbert's always around. But how do you know his name? Hello, hello. You are an exotic beauty. What is your name? <laughs> Esmeralda is my name, and gold and silver is my game. Oh, Esmeralda. I think I'm falling in love with you. If you really love me, give me something precious. The most precious thing I have for you, Esmeralda, I will give to you as a token of my eternal love. No! Esmeralda is my name. Gold and silver is my game. So gold and silver I shall give to you as long as I live. Hey, Captain! Go have a little drink with me. I am a captain. I don't drink gin. I drink rum. Okay then, Captain. Down the hats. Oh, darling. Come closer. I'm not that kind of Girl, Captain. Oh.
Ich hab ihn. What? In the eyes of the Machai illuminates the divine understanding. Illuminates the divine will. Illuminates the divine reason. For here, there's no there. And then, no, no. So be aware, you demons of Babylon, by the power of the lower, Lenti Magi, I demand you, you demons of Babylon, to set me free, to set me free. How are you doing? Where's Spider? You can always use a good man. Spider's off the coast. Uh, he's he's not going to be back for a little while. Uh, but let me introduce you to Signor Marco. He's the producer and manager of tonight's show. You running the show here tonight? I've always enjoyed performing for charity. You know, give back. Tell me, where is this money going? The poorest of the poor, Mr. Diva. Oh, I just came back from a world's tour. I had a great time. I can tell you, everybody is rocking out there. So where are your bodyguards, Mr. Diva? They are spread all around the camping, keeping the paparazzis and groupies at bay. Tell me, what time is showtime? What time is do I go on? 2200 hours sharp, sir. Tell me. Is there a band before me to warm up the crowd? Yes, they are called the Butifaras Blancas. Real amateurs, as you requested. My cocktail is ready. I think I'll head down to the clubhouse and meditate. I have all the ingredients ready. The vodka, the dragon's blood, and the toad. It's getting really hard to find that toad these days, though. Hey, Skipper, is the diva's drink ready yet? I present to you the Blue Pharaoh Lollipop. Well, I believe you're a captain. You must have some tales to tell. I insist you bring those two glasses and join me in the cabin. All right, Mr. Diva, at your service. Captain Wigley, of the Seven Seas. Well, is this the clubhouse, Captain? Yes, Mr. Diva. Follow me. Hey, Murphy, Mr. Diva, we're going to have a great, great show tonight. <laughs> Come on, Murphy, give, give me a hug. Go, go clean yourself up, Captain. We've got a busy night tonight. How's it going with Herr Norbert, um, Esmeralda? He gave me all this gold, real gypsy gold. And you and the captain, is he still in love with you? You see, he gave us this job to sell tickets for the concert. A lot of money will run through our fingers. Our sticky fingers. Yes. One ticket. Uh, are you all real gypsies? There is the mountain and there is the sea. I'm Esmeralda and this is Gypsy Lee. My name is Mr. Frufru. I'm a famous artist and the personal friend of Sadiva. I must be on the guest list. Is there any Mr. Frufru on the guest list? 
It's no fufu from the guest list. It's only sugar, cherry, um, suki and conchita. Fruit fruit, you've got to pay. Okay, so I pay. Very sorry, you've got to pay. Where's the sexy captain everybody's been talking about? Yes, this is me, Captain Wiggly. Now what can I do for you? My name is Lara. If you let me in for free, I'll meet you backstage later. How about it? Well, Tibor, get the guest list. We're going to put Lady Lara on it. Hey, no fraternizing, no flirting with ladies, and that is an order, Captain, an order. Yes, my darling, Gypsy Lee. No, hey, lovely lady, you've got to pay. Oh, no. Hey, sorry, I pay for her. Two tickets, please. Two? Yeah, please. Thank you. Thank you. Never mind. Well, thank you. That captain is boring, but you are a lovely young man. Let's go to the concert. Can I hold your hand? I'm on the guest list. My name is Suki. Me make breakfast for Captain Wrigley. Sushi, raw sushi. We got cheaper tickets than box office. Why the cheaper? Black market, my friend. Black market. I'm in, mate. I'm in. Oh, hello, nice ladies. I like to have a ticket for tonight. Yes, it's of twenty. Course. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Ticket, please. What time does the diva play? I believe it's at eight o'clock. We love you all, darling. Mr. Diva, ten minutes and you're on. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, my gender benders. Good evening, transvestites. Good evening, hermaphrodites. Welcome again. I give you the sweetest superstar, the Diva. New pharaoh, where art thou? In this, the time of speed, you move and you need a number for a meal, a black market deal. New pharaoh, where art thou? Snow spiders are burning to white ashes. The albino is guided by the polar bear. Be aware, be aware, and take good care. You look for the light, to what is right. Snow spiders burning throughout the night. New fellow, where art thou? No space, no space, as you take your place. Walk hand in hand, a lion and a Everybody, we're going to have a break now. We're going to have a 15 minute interval, okay? Now, please have some snacks, some beers, and there's some butifaras on the barbecue. Help yourself, enjoy. The diva will be back later with his band, The Shadows of Heaven. Thank you very much. Now, please, can anybody help me find my darling Gypsy Lee, please? Anybody? Where are you, Gypsy Lee? Where are you, Gypsy? Boss, I got some bad news. I went to go pick up the cash and the gypsies are gone. And I think they took all the money too. What do you mean it's all gone? Sorry, boss. I, I think they got every penny. Do you think Wiggly has anything to do with it? You think he's in on it? I mean, I worked him over pretty good, boss, and uh, pretty sure he knows absolutely nothing. You know, to be honest, I'm starting to feel sorry for him. He's a, he's a broken old man. So what are we going to do about these gypsies? Boss, even if I had Spider here with me, which I don't, we need a small army to go against the gypsies. And to be honest, I don't think we want to start a war with the gypsies. You're probably right. It's only a quarter meal. It wasn't worth the hassle. Anyway, we're supposed to be in Vegas tomorrow. 
Well, after all, it was a benefit concert, and the money did end up going to the poorest of the poor, which <laughs> this time wasn't us. <laughs> I absolutely hate camping. Let's get out of this dump. As a blackbird in the spring, she's a willow tree. Sad I'll tie a herd and sing, sing of Gypsy Lee. Gypsy Lee, Gypsy Lee. Made of golden hair, sunshine came along with tea, music in the air. I haven't paid the rent to Herr Norbert for six months. My love has run away. My love, my gypsy Lee. So I say goodbye, Captain Wiggly of the Seven Seas. Goodbye, my love, my gypsy Lee. A last salute and a last bottle of rum. To you, my stars, to you, my sun, to you, my silvery moon, I will be with you very soon. <laughs> Don't shoot, Captain Wiggly of the Seven Seas. You will no longer be able to have a drink with me, your lovely Gypsy Lee. Esmeralda, remove the love spell. Your brother, which is my husband, the Duende de Sevilla, is looking for us. Come on, quick, remove the spell. Hurry, Esmeralda, you have to remove the love spell. Captain Vigli, you are free from the love spell. Good Lord, what has happened to me? And who are you? And who is this chap? You don't remember me? I'm Gypsy Lee. And this is my husband, El Duende de Sevilla. Hey you, Englishman. Stay away from my wife and sister. Hijo de la gran puta. Has he told you? Has he tried to kiss you? You, mamo, te voy a rajar. Aceite piadero. No te acerques más a mi mujer, hijo de la gran puta que te voy a rajar aquí. Ah, no, no. Ten cuidado conmigo, ¿eh, inglés? Ten cuidadito. Good Lord. I have to sit down and smoke a pipe. Hello, Captain. How are you today? I'm sorry, Herr Norbert. I'm completely broke. I can't pay you the rent. Soon, I'm back on the street. After all, that's where I belong. Don't worry so much. Your lady, Gypsy Lee, has paid the rent for a whole year. <laughs> she must like you very much. Never tell her husband. He will kill you. Hey, hey, Norbert, is that so? And how is Esmeralda, the other strange lady? I think she's very happy with all the gold I gave her. <laughs> you tell me, this is chocolate. Oh, you wicked, wicked man, Herr Norbert. Something smells really good. You know, I'm fond 
of your culinary creations very much. You think I can have some of the sausages, please? I'm in a very good mood. You can have just one. Just one? Just one. Oh. And toast. A little bit of toast. And eggs. And beans. And mushrooms. Can I have a little bit of all these ingredients? You can have just one sausage, so don't push it. I want some more. No, no, that's all you're getting. One sausage, I told you. Egg. Mushrooms, tomatoes, and beans, the full English, you see there? How's your sausage? It's well done. Can I ask you a question? A question, of course. Your English? You really have a way with the ladies. What is that what you people have and what we don't have? Captain Woodley here, can I help you? Hello, my name is Igna and I come from Sweden. You have a lovely garden here. Are these olive trees? Yes, th these are olive trees, the trees of ancient civilization. Please, Captain Bigle, can I pick some olives? Of course, Inga. Pick as many as you want. No, I'm not cutting the sausage. Inga, darling. You can't eat olives like that. They're far too bitter. You have to pickle them. Yaha! So come with me to my tent and I'll show you how to pickle olives. Come on. Yaha! Well done, Herr Kapitän. Inga gets her pickle, and me finally the full English. Mm. 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 Mm.